Yo, 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 what's going on at the fight world? It's your boy Money back with another one, fam. This one here is on three big dogs in this fight game. We have Earl the True Spence Jr., the former WBC, IBF, and Super WBA Unified Welterweight World Champion, looking to be a two division world champion at 154 pounds now. Then we have Terrence T. Boyd Crawford, the undefeated three division world champion, and he's a two time undisputed. Um, champion in the Fort Belt era, the current undisputed champion at the welterweight division. And then we have Floyd Money Mayweather, arguably the greatest fighter of all time. Mr. Undefeated himself, Mr. 50 and 0, Mr. Billion Dollar Man himself. And we all know what Floyd did for the sport of boxing. But Floyd Mayweather wouldn't let Turnbull Crawford know that they're not on the same level and that he respect him. But um, it's just he done so much more. And, you know, these dudes got to catch up because the boy said hi. Um, Y'all listen to what Floyd had to say, and I'll be back with the great assessment, family. Terrence Crawford is a hell of a fighter. Yes, Only he is. Checo is a hell of a fighter. Do I think they're going to be in the Hall of Fame? Absolutely. But we're not talking about money, Mayweather. Let's talk about Pretty Boy Floyd. Right. Mm -hmm. Now, when we're talking about Pretty Boy Floyd, we're talking about a 90% knockout ratio. We're talking about fast hands, fast feet, combination. I mean, a complete fighter. But you remember, I was a professional as a teenager. So after, after the Sean Bay Mitchell fight, my body was completely broke down. So as y'all can see, Floyd right there letting people know that he did something totally different than this man right here in Terrence Crawford. Like he said, Terrence Crawford most definitely is a Hall of Famer. Can't take nothing away from him, man. He's a hell of a fighter. But he's not me. He's not me. You understand? Um, he haven't fought the competition that I fought. He haven't fought the Hall of Famers that I fought. He haven't, you know, did the things that I've done, even though he's a two-division um, undisputed world champion, right? He didn't really go through hard, rough knots to get there. You understand? What I fought is something different. And those are facts. Those are facts. Turnsbill Crawford resume do not stack up with Floyd Money May resume at all. Nowhere near it. Let's be realistic. Yes, Bud is a hell of a fighter, man. Look at his skill set. He got a hell of a skill set on him. But it's, it's, it's night and day. You understand? He got my dude, EJ. He beat Earl Spence. Credit to him for beating EJ, right? They got the rematch going on. We got to see how the rematch play out. You feel me? But Earl, a future Hall of Fame, if you ask me. I, I, got, I got to put it out there. Earl is a future Hall of Fame, if you ask me. But how many more future Hall of Famers did Terrence Bud Crawford beat? You know what I'm saying? Like, EJ is a motherfucking animal, a dog. You dig? So he get credit for my guy. No excuses, no none of that. No none of that. But when people look at the resume and say, well, Bud, you know, this guy was okay, this guy was okay, this guy was halfway out the door, this guy was halfway out the door. That guy right there, Earl the True Spence Jr., you did that. You know what I'm saying? You did that. But besides EJ, right, um, the resume don't really blow people away. Now, we respect the game because we know what we're looking at, and we understand the fighters, you know, that, that we see, and we can say they're some cool fighters, but nothing like Floyd fault. Nothing like Floyd fault. And, you know, Floyd going to keep it real all the way around the board, and I agree with him. I agree with him, bro. You understand what I'm saying? I agree with him. Floyd set the bar high for these dudes. You know what I mean? Now, people can go out there and probably debate on, or oh, do you think that Will Terrence Crawford beat Floyd Mayweather? You know, you're trying to compare error versus error and shit like that, right? But when you look at the resume, when you look at the money, when you look at the accolades, it's night and day, y'all. It's night and day. We talking about a three-division world champion compared to a five-division world champion. You feel me? A three-division world champion compared to a five-division world champion. Yes, turns, but Crawford was undisputed at 140, undisputed at 47. But how many belts did Floyd collect? Collect through five divisions. How many champions did he beat? How many Hall of Famers did he beat? How much money did he make? How long was his career? What impact did he have on the game? What impact did he have on the game? That's the question. That's the question, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls all over the world. How long was Floyd on top fighting that caliber of fighters? You dig? And then you say the impact. Did Terrence Bill Crawford really leave a big impact on the game? Because Bud on his way out the door. 
and Bud trying his best to get the big money fights out there with Canelo. He even mentioned Javante Tank Davis' name. You know what I mean? That money smelled good to him now. But Floyd was doing that shit constantly, 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 bro. Constantly, bro. To where Floyd took over Cinco de Mayo and the Mexican holiday. May and September. You dig what I'm saying? Terrence Crawford ain't having that type of impact, bro. He's not. Let's be realistic. He's not having that type of impact. Nowhere near it. <laughs> Nowhere near it. To where you know you're selling means of pay-per-view buys every time you go on pay-per-view. And people don't even like you like that. But you're still selling means of pay-per-view buys. That just show you that Floyd Mayweather was on a different level, bro. Superstar status on a different level. To where he's building superstars. It's like, it's night and day. It's night and day, bro. You understand? Now, Terrence Crawford... He's going to say that he can beat Floyd Mayweather. I can respect that. He's a fighter, bro. He's a fucking fighter. He's supposed to say that. That's how he's supposed to feel. You're not supposed to say nobody can beat you. So I can respect that. And like I say, that's the argument that you guys are going to put out there. Right? That's going to be the argument that you guys put out there. But to say that if his career can fuck with Floyd Mayweather's, is nowhere near it, bro. Nowhere near it. You know what I mean? And the argument to say if he can beat Floyd Mayweather... Is is you know you got you can you can it's a fantasy match so of course you're gonna have some things you can mix and match and say this and that about. But is he Floyd Money Mayweather? Is he better than Floyd Money Mayweather? Let's stop the bull jive, bro. Let's stop the bull jive. Man, it's nowhere near it. Nowhere near it, bro. Let's stop it. You feel me? Skill sets are two totally different skill sets. Skill sets are two totally different skill sets. You feel me? So when Cass out here talking about, man, Bud just like Floyd. Bud just like, no, nobody is like Floyd, bro. Nobody. They can try to mimic that man all they want to. They not no fucking Floyd Money Mayweathers. No Devin Haney's, no Shakira's, no Tank, no, no, no Earl, no Buds, no nothing, no Boots, no none of that. It's only one Floyd Money Mayweather. I'm going to repeat that. There's only one Floyd Money Mayweather. And y'all know that's my GOAT. And y'all know I studied that man from the bottom to the top. From the bottom to the top, bro. Nowhere near it. You know what I'm saying? Like I came out, I made a statement. I seen the kid that made Floyd Mayweather-ish moves. And Abdullah Mason. That boy made some Floyd Mayweather-ish moves. You dig? But there never been nothing Floyd Money Mayweather, man. And Terrence Bud Crawford is not on Floyd level. Um, he's a hell of a fighter, Hall of Fame fighter, but there's a lot of Hall of Fame fighters out there. You know what I'm saying? Floyd's number one Uno, bro. He's the number one fighter of all time to me, if you ask me, with the shit that he's done inside the ring and, you know, the, the impact he had on the sport of boxing and how he changed the sport of boxing. You feel me? And that's just real talk. So let's cut out the Terrence Crawford and Floyd Mayweather comparison because it don't mix. Not at all. Just be realistic with it. Bud is a hell of a fighter in his own right, but he's not fucking with Floyd. And that's just facts. Straight like that.